Hi, the next thing I want to talk about is the channel box. The channel box is a really important thing in Maya that you'll need to get used to using. Or excuse me, that you'd want to get used to using. So look, you can tell I've manipulated this object. Maybe you're not sure how. But when I select the object, the channel box appears. Now if the channel box doesn't appear, you just hit Control A on either the Mac or PC and it'll toggle between two things. Right now this is the attribute editor. I'll go back again to the channel box. So let's say I've manipulated this with any of my manipulators, but I want to reset it to its default size or rotation or position. All I have to do is click once and drag down on these numbers and let's say that I'm going to make all my rotation values and translation values their default. So I'll just simply type in the number zero hit return and it'll reset it to its original setting. Now for scale all I have to do is click on the first one and pull down and I just type in a 1, hit return and now it's back to its original shape. So again if I'm moving something and um, I don't like its position I can numerically change it in time. So let's say I want this to be uh, an integer value so I can say it's going to be negative 3 I can change this to negative 3 and change this to let's say 5 or I can use the manipulators